Hey guys, I'm Tamara and I'm a wildlife biologist at the EPA. Today I'm going to talk to you about pollinators. So I actually found out about pollinators while I was a kid growing up in the middle of Atlanta. We had pollinators growing in the back of our yard in the middle of an urban center and I fell in love with them. I figured out that they were monarch butterfly caterpillars and I did what I could to protect them and that's when I knew that I wanted to be a biologist when I grew up. So today I'm going to show you an activity that you can do at home to help protect pollinators. Before we go any further, if you have any garden or outdoor space and you need to use pesticides, make sure you follow the label and dispose of them properly. This is a seed ball. This is what we're going to make. For seed balls, you have four ingredients, clay, soil, water, and native seeds. It's important to use native seeds because you want seeds that are acclimated to your local environment, soil, and climate. So, grab a pinch of clay, flatten it to about the size of a quarter, pinch of soil on top, pinch of seeds, and a dash of water. Now you, you don't want to use too much water like I just did, because <laughs> it might fall apart. If you do end up using too much water, just add a little bit of soil, and that should hold it together. And now we roll. Roll, roll, roll. So there you have your seed balls. If you're not going to plant them immediately, feel free to store them in any airtight container and plant them when you need to. I hope you enjoyed that activity. We're going to link to some resources below. Enjoy!